them of the lesson. Body parts. Use have got or has got. Great three. Lesson two. Hello boys, hello girls. Okay, children, and now let's start our lesson. Aims to talk about parts of the body to practice describing appearance. Watch the video. Module 1. Animals. Look and listen. Hair. Legs. Nose. Head. Hands. Ears. Mouth. Eyes. Look and listen. It's got one mouth. Now count and say. It's got three ears. It's got five legs. It's got three noses. It's got four hands. It's got four eyes. Let's learn new words. Repeat after me. Hair. Legs. Nose. Head. Hands. Ears. Mouth. Eyes. Okay, let's go over this one more time. Here. Legs. Nose. Head. Hands. Ears. Mouth. Eyes. Open your activity book, page 5, exercise number 3. Do the crossword puzzle. Number 1. Ears. Number two, here. Number three, mouth. Number four. Legs, number five, eyes, number six,
number six. Hands. Number seven. Nose. Number eight. Head. Okay. Check the answer. Number one. Yes. Number two. Hair. Number three. Mouth. Number four. Legs. Number five. Eyes. Number six. Hands. Number seven. Nose. Number eight. Head. Okay. Have got or has got. The verb have got, has got, is translated into Russia as have processed something and is used when we want to communicate that we have something and belong to us. For example, the phrase, I have got a cat. We can't translate. Literally. I have a cat, but in Russia we do not say so. We usually the, use the word it. I have a cat. It should be noted that English pronouns do not change by case, so the Russia I corresponds to the English I, her. Affirmative tenses. What order in an affirmative senses? Subject plus have got, has got plus complement. With the pronoun I, you, we, they, the verb have got is used. For example, I have got a cat. You have got a cat, we have got a cat, they have got a cat. With the pronoun he, she, it, the verb has got is used. She has got a cat. Have, has got. I, you, they, we. He, she, it. Negative sentence are contrasted in the third way as a formative sentence, but the negative particle not added to the verb have got, has got, have not got, haven't got, has not got. I haven't got a cat. Question sentence. To ask a question, you need to change the world order, but the verb hub has before the subject will the god remains in place. Have you got a cat? Do you have a cat? Has he got a cat? Does he have a cat? Has Tom got a cat? Does Tom have a cat? Uh, for example, have you got a cat? Has he got a cat? The short answer is based on the following shim. Yes, have, no, haven't. Yes, has, no, hasn't. Inside it of the elicit scene, you must subject the paper pronoun, for example. Have you got a cat? Yes, I have. Has Tom got a cat? Open your people's book, page 7, exercise number 7. Complete use have got or has got. 
Number one, we have got green eyes. Number two, not the big, big hands. Number three, they brown hair. Number four, I a small nose. Number five, my sister red hair. Number six, you a small hat. Okay, check okay, check the answer. We have got green eyes. Nurlebek has got big hands. They have got brown hair. I have got a small nose. My sister has got red hair. You have got a small hat. Okay. Thank you for the lesson. Goodbye.